Today I'll be showing you how to build the Villa 160 bench. With your Villa 160 bench, you'll receive the seat, the arms and legs, and a bag of fixings. In your bolt pack, you'll receive eight short zinc bolts and two slightly longer ones. The tools you'll need are a 13 mm spanner. A rubber mallet is useful, but not necessary. Flip the Villa 160 on its end. This makes for quite a high work area. Take the longest of the bolts and use that through the back of the armrest to drop into the first pre-drilled hole. You then line up and drop in the remaining four bolts. Now you just tap them in with the rubber mallet. This will pinch them in and make the assembly secure. Now try to fix the washers and nuts at the same time and do them up finger tight. You finish them off with a spanner and try not to over tighten them as this may crush the wood. Now repeat the process for the other side. Pepe Garden Furniture is pressure treated. This process can leave batten marks as you see here but they weather in over time. We recommend that you use the furniture protector provided with every kit in half litre, one litre or two and a half litre tins, depending on the size of the item. This should be applied every two to three years, depending on exposure, evenly to the outside. Concentrate a little bit more on the end grains and the end of the legs for this darker finish. So here you have it, your finished Villa 160. All you need to do now is sit back and relax.